Hello, this should be an enticing prospect. Welcome to the Estadio de Vallecas. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Rayo Vallecano, and they take on Osasuna. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here's how it looks for Rayo Vallecano. Well, although it's down as a 4-5-1, it's more likely to be three players in behind the main centre forward, and those three are key to this team's creativity. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield. Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Now the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Oros. And the defensive intervention there. And to Budimir. Unable to keep the ball that time. giving the ball to the opposition that time can they create something from here a fine reading of the situation Aymar Oroz well this could really real chance and pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Not a bit short with the clearance. Just couldn't get it through. Not chasing the game, but now a corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Managed to get it out of there. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Oh, super stop. Wonderful goalkeeping. Valentin, high pressing and good high pressing. Well, the visitors have had most of the ball in the last 15 minutes and have been really positive with it. They're creating opportunities and it's surely only a matter of time before they draw level here. Well, let's see if they can win the ball back and create something else. Now, breaking at pace. Potential danger. Is it going to be? And begging to be put away. There it is. And he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor, but he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Unai Lopez. Well, there we have it. Time is up as far as the first half is concerned here at the Estadio de Vallecas.
And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What a good performance. Well, they've got things going again here. And I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. And stuffing out the danger. Distributing it well. Could reduce the deficit. And he does. There is hope for them, despite the adversity they suffered earlier. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? And he's broken free. Oh, great defending. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Can he put it away? And a goal! They've increased their lead, and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, here it is again. What a ball that is over the top of the defence. It's weighted perfectly and then through on goal. You never really had any doubt that he wouldn't slot that away. It's a cool finish. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Lucas Toro. Oros, well read to win possession back. Being pressed here. Oh, in with a chance! Can he put it away? Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won! And continues his run. Well, the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Chance to reduce the arrears. The same. It was a good one. Well, they're going for the short one. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Oscar Trejo. Now, who can he play it to? The fans are shouting, shoot! Oh, a really crisp effort, but just wide. So, making the substitution now. Another good tackle. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Oscar Valentin. And passing it through. And a goal to seal the hat trick. A master class in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Mm -hmm. 
Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Cruz. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Catena. The ball with Lucas Toro. Ruben Peña. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance.